here is my castle base. It starts like this and obviously it looks a little different already. Put some turrets up there and then over here, I mean obviously all this stuff wasn't there, I'll get to that in a second. Over here there is a big gaping hole. I put tons of foundation things to make like some weird steppy thing which is one way to get inside this little building that I made and you can also oh I blocked that you can not go through the other way um, but now you can go in here and there's this area with all my vendors they sell me things um, there's a dining table where this guy likes to sit and a pool table um, you can go up here you can go up one more level where some of my vent this is where the vendors sleep they they like to hang out pretty close to where they sell stuff and then some statues up here you can get up on the very tippy top of this roof see more statues and kind of have an overlook um this is kind of my favorite building in the middle because it's just cool looking inside because as you'll see um, catwalk here, lots of plants, potted plants in here with a nice ambiance and a bar. Um, this guy is really cool. It's he like I came from uh, that Diamond City place and I gave him a job. He's real happy about it. He's the bartender. Everybody likes to hang out here. Anyway, you go down here, you end up back at where this guy sits at the radio, which you'll remember. Here's some of my power armors, and there's like some nice lights on it. And now I have three people watching. Um, glad, glad that you all are enjoying my stream right now. There's some more beds. Um, some of you missed some of this tour here, but uh, it's pretty, just a pretty sizable castle settlement um, as you can see and now just for time's sake I'm going to show us the other settlement that I've done some work on which is this one up here and it will take probably a little while to load up it usually does that interesting conversation I overheard about games that are part of loading screens I just think it'd be really cool if we could be using our Pit Boy during the loading screen and playing one of those like mini games while we're loading. I think that would be awesome. I think I heard there's like weird copyright issues with doing stuff like that. Anyway, back to uh, the the main reason we're streaming, which is my settlement buildings. Um, I'll start out. Obviously, that's like the massive building I built. Just I like to to show people, my guests, I like to show them how much water I, I make here because it's a substantial amount of water. Um, I think it usually, I, I end up making, let's see, 360 water. So I don't, I don't know, that averages me a lot of water all the time. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> not to brag or anything, you know, we just need to have a lot of water. It's a good, good thing to sell as well, makes, makes some money. For the settlement. Um, the other kind of first thing, just keeping with the utilities and resources, uh, is all these generators that I needed to use to power this settlement. I don't know how many of them are actually necessary because I just overkilled it and made sure that I could keep all the lights on. Obviously, lots of beds in here. I'll kind of let me back out a little bit. I hope this is working well because I have no idea if you're seeing a choppy video or a good one but this is kind of like one of the main entrances it's kind of where I started and I'm just building around this little mini hub that you kind of start out in I had some plants over here I just kept them so they're under underneath now inside that way my farmers can work, can work in the safety of the building. Um, you know what? Since we talk, yeah, some of those settlers say things to me sometimes. Here's kind of 
I used to, this was like my room and my home down here. I loved this area for a while. I kind of moved to the castle. Um, but if you go up, you can see there is some power armor kind of on display with some fancy lights above it. And um, you can go up another level, just kind of overlook everything. Here's my version of Sean's crib. I just put it there in case, at the time, I didn't know if I'd find him, if he'd be a baby or what, and I just thought, you know, if he might want something that resembles his home, and when I find him, I just want to make sure I have that. So, put that there. You can go up another level. There's a lot of paintings, some areas for them to hang out, my settlers. And a little deck out here. Um... On the roof, I, I built some stuff that you're not going to want to see if, if you don't like spoilers. There's just some things that I built kind of towards the end of the game. Don't worry about those. They're just stuff that happens later on if you're not there yet. Uh, yeah, that's, that's pretty much it with this settlement. I had some tough areas. There was... I, I really struggled to build right in here because there's like these weird grassy things that you can't build around sometimes and I got stuck and I'd be trying to move something and it'd be like no you can't build here because there's grass and I was like I want to get rid of the grass but it wouldn't go away so I just built weirdness around it and got kind of mad at it and then quit worrying about it but yeah I think it looks pretty cool from out here this is one of my favorite views. Oh, another thing I'm thinking about adding this addition over here, but never really got around to it. I really liked these these cool looking metal um, prefabs. I wanted to make a hallway into a whole other sector or wing of the settlement over here, but I stopped because a sane person would stop at that point. I think or probably a lot sooner, but I stopped then, because that's how sane I am. Anyway, I'll leave it at that, guys. Thank you so much for joining, and uh, please leave me comments if you wish, and, and come back soon. So, I'm going to end the stream there, guys. Thank you.